Ladies and gentlemen, can I please have your attention? I've just been handed an urgent and horrifying news story. And I need all of you to stop what you're doing and listen. We got Android 13, motherfucker! What up, Dokoners? Welcome back to Toonami for another video on Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle. It is finally, finally here. The wait is over. We can now rainbow the unit that had the most difficult grind in the entire game. Who am I talking about? I'm talking about Tech Android 13, the free-to-play unit. They finally added this guy in the Baba Shop. I have been waiting for this day for so long. So long. I even made a video about this because I thought like four months ago they were actually going to drop this update like they did for JP. JP got the update for this unit at the same time that they got their quality of life change where everything got sped up, the inventory increased. I thought Global would get the same treatment. Clearly I was wrong by so much. But who cares? We now have the unit. So here it is. The update just happened on Global. You can now exchange the treasure item Incredible Gem for the deadliest fusion power Android 13 in the Baba Shop. It costs 100 gems per copy. You can only get up to four. So what that does is it makes your life so much easier, but you still gotta go through the grind once. So basically this unit is so difficult to grind once, you had to do it five times if you wanted to actually rainbow the guy before. A lot of people have done it, including Jay Fanta and a couple other people that I know. So props to you guys, you guys are insane. I thought I was insane, but clearly I'm not compared to you guys. So this unit right here, there's a video that I made on how to awaken this guy, where to get the units, uh, where to get the medals, so be sure to check out the video. I'm gonna add that in the video, uh, either in the, in the description or in the little thingy above right here. Mwah! So uh, take a look at that. But this guy, uh, it was a very, very, very tough grind to get this guy. So what they basically did was reduce the amount of grinding you have to do to just one time through. So you first get this guy, and then in order to awaken him into his fusion form, you have to get 20 copies of each of these medals. That takes a very, very long time, people. A very, very long time. So imagine having to do that five times. That's way too much. So what they did was they made you do the grind once, and if you do it, then you can buy the rest of them right here for 100 gems each. And I'm going to do this right now on this recording because this is a monumental moment for me. Two, number three. Oh yes, and the final piece of the puzzle. Now I can rainbow this guy. He can finally be rainbowed. All right. So he's also going to be getting a do. Uh, do okay. So um, I couldn't do it. I don't have enough orbs. And uh, I desperately need the world tournament to come back. Anyway, that's not what this is about. Forget it. I didn't rainbow him. Fine. <laughs> Fine. Okay, here it is. This is the unit. How do you want to build this guy? Let's take a look at his pre and post EZA. His pre ZA leader skill is a 40% attack and defense boost, plus key plus two to physical, STR, and tech. His super attack causes supreme damage and lowers defense. His passive skill, key plus four, attack plus 70, when key is eight or more. So basically, all you need is key plus eight and then you've got yourself a super. That's the point of this guy. When he gets his EZA, he gets a massive, massive upgrade. He becomes a 60% across the board lead for tech, STR, and physical. He causes supreme damage and greatly lowers defense. Key plus four, attack and defense plus 80% when key is eight or more. Attack and defense plus 30% when there are three or more Android category allies on the team. Basically, this guy is built around having Android allies on the team, and when you do, you will automatically be giving him 30% extra on top of your guaranteed super, basically, because all you need to get a super with this guy is 8 key. So once you get 8 key, you get a super. When you get the super, you get 110% attack and defense. That's really, really good considering where this guy came from. He was the laughing stock of Dokkan, and now he is respectable, and he is going to be a very solid free-to-play Android unit, which could mean we can now maybe do free-to-play Android Super Battle Run. I might give that a shot. 
So this is what you're going to be getting if you rainbow this guy. He's worth the investment. He's worth the time. Now that you can actually get this guy from the Incredible Gem Shop in a much easier way, you should definitely go for the rainbow for this guy. I highly recommend it. And also, his other, uh, the int version for this guy is also getting an EZA when the Epic 7 EZA units show up. Um, I think they're going to be showing up in like a week, maybe less than a week. So this guy, when he gets the EZA, he massively lowers defense. So this is the summonable version of the free-to-play one that we were just talking about. So both of these units are very, very good. Basically, the point of this video is to go farm this guy out, grind it all the way through just once, and then the rest can be done via the gem shop. This is a huge get, people. I am so happy. I have been liberated. I don't have to do this anymore. So thank you so much for watching, guys. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like down below. Let me know in the comments if you've already done this grind. If you are one of those people who did the rainbow before any of this came up, let me know in the comments down below. Also, be sure to subscribe for more dope content in the future and click that notification bell so that you let YouTube know you want to see more of my stuff. Do it. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned. And always remember to dokon responsibly.